For the first time, 7 News can take you inside the Sydney Water Labs, where scientists are testing for cancer-causing forever chemicals. They've made their way into the catchment at levels deemed too dangerous in America, but experts insist our tap water is safe. At a quarantine lab, relentless testing. The front line in the fight against the toxic forever chemicals which have made their way into our water catchment. These samples taken at Blackheath in the Blue Mountains. Scientists must adhere to the strictest of rules. Our team don't shampoo their hair or wear sunscreen or even makeup 24 hours before they do their testing. PFAS chemicals are everywhere. PFAS chemicals do cause cancer. Some filter companies cashing in on fear. Advanced water treatment processes are the only way to, to remove PFAS from, from drinking water. It's very important to differentiate between an untreated water source, like a dam, and a treated water source. Recent testing found the level of PFAS in our treated tap water sampled from sites across Sydney is well within the Australian guidelines. Those standards, however, are currently under review. The US recently setting a much lower safe limit. Seven News understands results of that review are expected in the coming months. Concerns about PFAS in drinking water have prompted a whole of government response. And while the focus has been on what's in tap water, scientists say we should be looking at how much PFAS is in our plastic water bottles. We can be very confident that Sydney's water is very safe to drink. Serena Andaloro, Seven News.